Well, you guys going to have a quick video here for you on how to remove the home page in the settings panel right here. So when you open up the settings panel on Windows 11 now, you'll see this home panel here. And some people say they don't want it and they want to be able to disable it. Whether you're running Windows 11 Home or Windows 11 Pro or above, it doesn't really matter. I'll show you how to do it via the group policy editor and also the registry editor. So if you're running Windows 11 Pro here, I'll quickly show you how to do this in the group policy editor first. And then if you're running Windows 11 home version, I will show you how to do it in the registry editor. So first, let's go to the search and type GPO to open up the group policy editor. This will open up this window right here. From here, we're going to go to compute configuration. And then we want to go to administrative templates. And then once that's open, go to control panel and click on there. Once you click on control panel, from there on the right hand side, we're going to be looking for settings page uh, visibility. So this is going to be for your home page. So what we're going to do here is double click on this one here, and this box will open up like so. What you need to do here is enable this policy. And down here, you'll see the settings page visibility. So we're going to do hide colon and then home. And this is going to hide the home page uh, from there. So let's go ahead and apply this and click OK. And now that's done. That policy is now set in place. And if we go back and check the uh, settings page here, so click start and then hit settings, you'll see straight away it goes straight into the system page where you get access to all of these rather than getting the home page where you'd have to then go ahead and click on another page. So if you want to remove that, that's how you can do it. Let me show you how to do it in the registry editor if you're running Windows 11 Home. So go ahead and open up the registry editor. Open up the H key local machine. And then from there, we're going to go to software. So click on software and then navigate all the way down to where you see Microsoft. And then we want to go all the way down to the bottom where it says Windows. So go down to where it says Windows. And once we get down the bottom, let me just scroll down here and click on Windows. And there it is right there. And then we need to click on current version. So click on current version. Open this one up. Then go to policies. And once we hit policies, we'll be able to open this up. And we should then see Explorer. So let me go down to policies here. There it is. Open this up. And then you should see Explorer. There we go. Click on that one. So on the right hand pane, what we need to do is we need to create a new string value. So right click and go new. And then click string value. Inside that string value, you need to put in this actual name here. So it's going to be called settings. And then we're going to be doing page and then visibility. You need to put capital letters for settings and then for page and then for visibility, but it needs to be all one word. So settings, page, and then visibility like so. And then once we've got that done, what we can do is we can double click on that entry. And what we can do is we need to put in a name. So let's go ahead and double click and open this up. Little box will pop up here. Inside here, you're going to be typing hide colon home, just like we did in the group policy, but here we're doing it in the registry. So hide colon home and then click OK. And once that's done, you should see it looking like this. Now you can go ahead and when you click on the start button and then click settings, the home page will be removed and you will just see your settings here for your system. So let's go ahead and click on this here. And the home page has now been removed from the menu on the left hand side. And you're going straight into where you was before they did the update. So if that's what you want to do, you can do that. If you want to remove it, you can click delete in the registry or turn it off in the uh, group policy editor. And that will be perfectly fine. And it will go back to having the home there. Anyway, that is it. That's just a quick video on how to remove the home page in Windows 11. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support. I shall catch you in the next video or see you on the Discord server for a chat. Bye for now.